Alexander Vilenkin's theory of how our universe came from nothing. A poem by Peter Reynosa. O Slavic child from the barbaric edges of the Western world, O civilised, enlightened, Spartan American beast, bravely whispering a demonic theory of primeval creation that even Satan wouldst not dare to ever partake or fiendishly feast. Divining like an evil oracle, an unmerciful truth, beyond all earthly words and thought, trumpeting a view of Stygian origins, that holy men of our most sacred religions cannot fathom, but still have valiantly, hopelessly fought. Yet, one mystics may have both sensually experienced and also unwisely, evilly and self-damningly sought. What roamed before the infinity of timelessness and the providence of boundless space? What travelled before any of our dimensions or the primordial energy and the vile materialism of our disgrace. Yes, what madness reigned before the divinity of science that we now incestuously embrace? What soulless creature ruled before causality and logic or the curse of death's gentle grace? Ye saith, the universe begat out of nothing, even though this be beyond all common sense. Ye posit an hypothesis of quantum fluctuations, of how our fireball came by tunnelling out of a void of unbeing that did mysteriously somehow commence. Even unbelievers must genuflect to the mathematical when it correlates to the real of the observed life. Still, how can a soul accept an event that spawned all existence from a phantom nothingness that be more barren than the imagined loyalty of a betraying Judas wife? Ye tell a tale of Genesis that be far more wicked than any of Mephistopheles' cruelest of crimes and blackest of sins. One where the gods be fabled eunuchs and our moral hearts but a tragic poem that be but mythic lying hymns. And all our spiritual nobility and heavenly bold, but a whimsical act of accidental nothingness without divine gold. And this all be a randomness, never fated, yet somehow also an inevitable destiny that had to be created.